having the new turf um, really opens up a lot of possibilities for us from a from a sports perspective in the fall and the spring. Um, here at Lakeville North, we're, we're really landlocked um, and we've kind of always been in a, in a difficult situation since we went from a 10-12 building to a 9-12 building many years ago. Um, there's just not enough space for all of our teams to, to practice and to have their games when it comes to soccer, football, marching band, lacrosse, um, softball, baseball, all of those programs, we, we kind of we struggle with, with space. The artificial turf allows our student athletes to have a safe, uh, repeatable surface that uh, is able to be played on over and over again. Uh, we can get many more teams through there, uh, hundreds of more kids, and uh, you know, like I mentioned before, a lot of times with the natural grass, it would just get, just get worn down to dirt or mud. It's opened up possibilities. It's allowed us to get more programs on the facilities um, here at the campus compared to using um, different off-site venues. Although we still do use off-site venues, um, just not as much as we had to in the past. So it's been a great addition to our school to have this new turf. We found that there's been less injuries with the turf, uh, and, and it really uh, it creates an environment where where we don't have to worry about. Um, a lot of the other maintenance issues that natural grass creates. The addition of the dome that's going to be going up over the the winter six months I think is a, it's a that'll be a huge benefit to our community as a whole. From a um, from a high school perspective um, we certainly will have big uses for that dome in the in the shoulder seasons. Um, at the end of, or at the end of our fall sports season Teams like football or soccer that may still be making a late run in the playoffs, they'll be able to use some indoor practice space if the weather gets bad uh, early in the spring season when it's always challenging to get outside with our outside sports because of either late snowfalls or a lot of rain that happens in the spring. The dome will be a, a, a big benefit for things like track, softball, baseball, and then of course lacrosse. And we're also hoping in the future to uh, to have our, our, our practice turf area here at Lakeville South Dome as well. But, um, understand that, that, that the North Dome is going to open first and we're really looking forward to, uh, to our students being able to have that experience uh, in, in the cold winter times or, or poor weather times without having to um, make significant travel. It helps us in football and FIED too to know that we have a place to play on. When we only had the one turf it took a um... It's always a struggle being able to find time to get all the teams on there to utilize our turf, so I really appreciate having more of an opportunity to get our own space, do practices right after school, um, and then I can get off to do all the other extra things I have to do outside of my sport and, um, on, and academics, so that's probably the biggest thing for me.